Last day of the week, leg day. Again, we're starting with a heavy lift. We're going for squats because, man, if I only got to do one workout for the rest of my life, it'd probably be squats. It works so many muscles at one time. So if your access is dumbbells, I would recommend holding them up top, kind of more of a front squat. Legs a little shorter than with, uh, legs a little wider than shoulder width apart. Keep that chest up and give me eight really good controlled strong squats five times through. All right, we finished our heavy set of squats. Now we're moving into our first circuit. This is going to contain three moves, Romanian deadlifts, step ups, and windshield wipers. Let's do it. Romanian deadlift, I'm gonna show you first front on and then I'll turn to the side. You wanna make sure your shoulder blades are back. That means your chest is popped out. Okay, you're holding dumbbells in. And instead of dropping your chest, I want you to think about pushing your hips back. So instead of dropping, I'm thinking about pushing my hips back as my dumbbells stay really close to my legs. And then to come up, it's like a pelvic thrust, okay? Not using my lower back. That's using to stabilize, but the movement is coming from that booty, okay? Watch me do a few with heavier weights, okay? I'm gonna drop down, stretch, 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 push forward and flex my booty. Let's see from the side. Stretch down, stretch, 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 push down. Stretch, 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 flex forward. Stretch, 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 squeeze the booty. All right, 10 heavy sets there, and then we're gonna go right into step ups. Second move of the circuit, you're gonna do bench step ups. If you don't have a bench, Use a step, use a chair, get creative. If you don't have access to any of that, no worries. We'll find a different move for you. But I'm gonna demonstrate what it looks like to do a bench step up. Choose one leg and you're gonna do all 10 reps on that leg first. I have my full foot on the ground, stepping up and tapping. My legs are usually pretty toast already, so I don't add weights here, but if I'm having a really strong day, I'll hold some weights by my side. All the way up, all 10 reps, squeezing my booty, and then rotating. Okay, 10 on each side. So you've done your Romanian deadlifts, and then you're going right into your step ups, and you're finishing with windshield wipers. This is a movement for your obliques. You're gonna lay flat on the ground, arms out, legs zipped up together. Try not to touch the ground. Can you see why they're called windshield wipers? If you need a, a modification, bend your legs. I also love this move because it's just a really nice, really nice spinal twist. It feels good. Okay, 10 reps total, working in that core. All three moves, back to back to back. Grab some water, do it four times through. All right, we've made it to the last circuit of the entire week. Three moves, just like we've been doing, back to back to back. We're gonna start with split squats, 10 on each side, go into hip thrusters, and then finish with reverse crunches. Watch me. Split squats. Again, leg on a bench, a step, elevated a little bit. Worst case, if you don't have a step, just do a regular lunge. But here's what a split squat looks like. You want your hips in alignment. You wanna pretend like there's a string attached to your head so you're nice and straight, and you're just gonna drop straight down, drive through your heel. Don't let me, I don't wanna see that heel come up. Find your balance, balance plant that foot, 10 on each side. Once we finish our split squats, 10 on each side, then we're gonna get into our hip thrusters. You can do these off the bench like I'm gonna display. You can do them off a stability ball very easily. Um, you can also, again, do them on the ground. You wanna grab a dumbbell, probably heavier than a five, but you know, bear with me. We're gonna jump down, support our neck, head, and shoulders, crawl out. Okay, we're all supported, we got a nice weight. I have to go pretty light because I had a C-section and I still feel numb right here. So I place the dumbbell um, below my groin area and it still works out, okay? So drive through the heels, squeeze that butt nice and heavy and give me that three second pause at the top. This is gonna build that nice shelf in the back. After we finish those, we're gonna cap it all off, give our legs a rest while we do reverse crunches. You can also, again, do these on the ground. I'm gonna display it on the bench. Grab onto something. So if you're on the ground, you could grab on, like I could grab onto that post, or I could just put my arms out flat. Legs out, maybe a slight bend, and reverse crunch into the ceiling. Okay? 
The more pointed that way you are, the more challenging it's gonna be. Have fun everybody, and remember, post questions in our Facebook group. If you have a question, probably someone else has the same question. I hope you guys enjoy these workouts and enjoy these 30 days together. I'll see you in the Facebook group.